Hey guys, what's going on? It's your art teacher, Mr. McMillan, back for another art lesson. Today, we are going to be drawing a bear wearing an ugly Christmas sweater. Are those sweaters really ugly? Well, maybe so, maybe not. You know, really what it comes down to is there is sometimes so much going on with the sweater it might be so busy um, that it can be tacky and sometimes considered ugly and sometimes it's so tacky it's just plain cool anyway let's get started on this lesson I think you're gonna enjoy it and I can't wait to see what you come up with okay first of all let's check out some different ugly sweater designs there's a lot out there, but sometimes they might include gingerbread and candy canes and snowflakes and different things like that. Maybe little wintry scenes and reindeer. And sometimes they're really beautiful and not so tacky like this sweater here. So the first thing you're going to do is draw a smile in the center of the paper. So I'm gonna make it pretty wide. I'm gonna have a smile that's gonna be for the neck of the bear and then I'm gonna draw two lines for the side of the bear that go off the paper. I am not gonna be able to see any arms or legs on my bear, just the side. Now I'm gonna draw a frown for the top of the head, so a, a line that's curved this way and then I will draw two rounded ears like this, kind of like a Winnie the Pooh bear, and like this, and bring it on down. So it looks pretty good. Uh, we'll do the eyes next, which we'll start with obviously two circles and then I'm gonna draw the pupils as well. And there's a lot of different ways you can go about doing the eyes, but this is a good one that works. I'm gonna draw a triangle for the nose. It's pointing down. And then for the mouth, you really can just do a little short line. You can make it curve up to smile or straight across to be more serious. I'm going to go ahead and fill in the nose just because I think it looks good that way. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to add some little details to the ears. And then we're going to add some stripes really to divide up the sweater area. So I'm leaving plenty of room to be able to draw designs inside of those stripes. Once you've divided up that area, then you want to decide what you would like inside of each area. I'll do some with line patterns some with other little details. There's a million different directions you could go with this, so you should just maybe check out some different ugly sweaters or think about what you want if you want, you know, some line patterns, if you want some snowflakes in there or whatever else. I'm drawing a very intricate zigzag pattern. Now after this, we're gonna go ahead and jump ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and finish mine, which you're welcome to pause and look at, and there's other times to look at that as well. So 
I added some arrows and some little almost like sunshines and string lights and things like that. For the face, I'm going to add some little lines for the fur. I like to start by going around the eyes this way and then I will just build up layers of that going around. And you can certainly skip this part or do it differently. You don't have to add these lines. I just kind of like the texture it adds to the bear's face. And I'm going to add a landscape line in the back, like a little hill. It's real simple. If you wanted to add some other detail in the background, that would be cool too. And after that, we're going to move on to some coloring, which um, I actually use paint to do the sky in this one, but you could use crayon or whatever you had. And then I'm going to color in the details of the sweater with colored pencils, but once again, you could use markers or whatever you have. And here we have it. My bear with an ugly sweater looks super cool, and I love it. I hope you guys enjoy it, and like I say, have fun. Can't wait to see yours.